In this example, we will show the UML diagrams and the SysML diagrams and explain how they interact and correlate and map to one another. So that will get started. What you're seeing here is a breakdown of the UML diagram types. We have structural diagram types and behavioral diagrams. And we have several different types of structural diagrams as well as several different types of behavioral diagrams. The diagrams that have the um, diagram icon below them are the ones that have a, an equivalent SysML mapping to them. So now we'll transition over to the SysML diagrams where we have nine different specific types of SysML diagrams. We have four behavioral and then we have four structural and then we also have the requirement diagram to make up nine. So and then we can show the mapping between the diagram types with the SysML diagrams on the top and the UML diagrams on the left. So to see the differences between the specific types, we can just click on the, some examples. Um, so this is a use case. And if I go to use case here, you can see that they're fairly similar. The, um, the coloring might be a little bit different. And that's going to be your theme for all these diagram types. What you're currently looking at is a class diagram and this is the equivalent in SysML, the BDD, and you can see that the, the coloring is a little bit different. Um, also if you're looking at uh, an activity diagram such as this one, uh, you can see that it, it forces the, uh, the arrows to be uh, straight and for the activity diagram you can it, it defaults to this sort of diagonal arrow format. So, but pretty much all these are going to look and feel the same. Um, the way to be able to find these diagrams is you just go to the create diagram button and you click on the expert and then you can minimize those and maximize the UML diagrams. So now you can see them together. So you can see that the use case diagram for UML and SysML and uh, pretty much the icons are going to be uh, blue for all the UML diagrams within Cameo and then the SysML diagrams have this icon color. So I hope that that helps uh, give some context. Thanks.